Now, fire service has what, two? What do you call them? Phase one and phase two. Phase three. one, yeah. This is phase one. And what's that? Buzzer goes off. That's to take the elevator out of service. Okay, so that immediately brings it to this floor? Yep, it brings it down to this floor, and it'll open the door. It will not ever close the door, just stay here at the first floor. With the, with the buzzer going? No, the buzzer will, the buzzer is defeated as soon as the door hits the open limit. Okay. And then it, it just stays here with the light, the light on. Okay. And then, like say if it was a real fire, we'd go in here and the... Uh... If we were firemen, we would take, put the uh, elevator on phase two, right, and then we... So the diff main difference is that uh, I is out. Okay. On independent, like over there, it's not out. Right? I see. And why is the I out? The I is out because in case smoke. Oh, smoke is. Smoke is filling the building. The yeah. I will will uh, trigger off of that smoke. Okay. Now, do, do the firemen carry their own keys? I yeah, yeah, we have the firemen on. Yep. Another another difference between independent is right the the door automatically opened. On independent, right? Uh -huh. On on fire service, right? Okay. What's going on right now? It does not open, right? That's another feature because if there's fire out here on this floor, yeah. we don't want to have the door open, right? Right. right so we what they have the elevators have a peak feature, right? So you just hit the door open button, right? Oh, look at that! Right? Yeah, it just opens real quick it'll, and it'll stop. Yeah. So if if you like, you would stay back here, right? And then you could hit that. And you can see or feel the heat. Yeah. And you know not to step out on the floor. Wow, that's wild. Now let's go LL. Do they, uh, are all the elevators keyed the same? With the no, fire every key? elevator is, is different. Really? Mm -hmm. There's, there's, they try to standardize them, but it, they've got it down to maybe like 12 or 13 okay. keys. Like Tissen have his own fire service yeah. key. There's like, Schindler has their own fire service key. Otis has their own okay. fire service key. I know that uh, never the twain shall meet, right? Right. So Purdue's got their own fire departments. They're probably you know keyed up pretty well. Yeah, they have all the we've we've got them all the keys. But I imagine like you know Lafayette City, I mean, they probably yeah, carry I mean, a lot of different keys. Yeah. Though. Well, Purdue's a special case, and Lafayette City, what they would have on on the main egress floor, uh -huh. the fire service, is a box. Oh. So the fire departments would have one key to get in the box. I and see. And that box has every key. I see. Okay. Okay, that now makes can sense. I, can I try these? Sure, sure. There. Let's see how close. Now, this, this is what they call a fire service test. How often do we do that? This is monthly. We do this okay. every month. Yep. There we go. So, is a lot of your guys' daily work, like maintenance type, just yeah. monthly checks? Go, boys. Wait around for something to break? Do you guys do a lot of preventative maintenance? Yeah. Like okay. what? Uh, what, what replace rollers, about? replace locks. A lot of consumables, right? Okay. Locks and uh, rollers. For almost three. You gotta do any yep. like uh, yeah. lubricating or anything? Oh, yeah. 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 It won't open until we're in the door zone. You can push that all you want. Just tap it, Jay. <laughs> oh, we're not there yet? Uh -uh. Now, we're, now we're there. There we go. And <laughs> Hey, just, Jay, just tap it like you said, that peak mode. Just. Man, I really appreciate you guys doing this. Hey, no very, problem. Very kind of you. Well, uh, we appreciate uh, you and Jay, guys. We, we, we got a kick out of it when we, we were typing in YouTube videos in yeah. uh, Purdue Elevators and we saw you guys. Yeah. And it, no, it's nice was... to see somebody enjoy our, our, our work. Yeah, no doubt. I understand, totally. If you would have told me you know, 12 years ago I'd be running around filming elevators, I'd told you you're crazy. <laughs> yeah. We actually just got back from, uh, from Boston. We... Uh, Jay and my dad and I, um, Jay, just tap that, just touch it one time real yep. quick. Ha! Jay, sure, Jay that's, that's the peak mode. <laughs> yeah. Is that what's called peak? Yep. There we go. And that was one, right? Let's go, go back one. up to one, huh? Yeah, let's put the other yeah, one back in Yeah, I want you to turn it off. Oh, okay. okay. Yep, we can do that. <laughs> so now does it automatically go to one? Yeah. Sure. Okay. I grew up in a little town named Marengo, Illinois, which is uh, near Rockford, Illinois, and mm -hmm. uh, uh, I grew up a block off of Route 20. And so I have three kids, Jay's got a twin brother, and then I have a daughter who's eight uh -huh. and nine. And, uh, we always find that uh, 